now. We are following multiple shootings in what was a violent weekend here in Indianapolis. There have been at least six shootings since Saturday. Police say they're not related. Three of the victims have died. Julia Dang is live at the headquarters for IMPD downtown. What do we know so far, Julia? Well, Scott, a lot to follow. Police have responded to more shootings in 24 hours than they typically do in a week. Right now, at least three people remain in critical condition. Take a look. This is the scene of one of the deadly shootings we're looking into. It happened yesterday afternoon on the northeast side. Two men were shot around 1245 on Cedarstone Drive. One died. The other is recovering. We talked to a neighbor who wasn't even shocked it happened in broad daylight. Sad, but it happens on a regular basis. Honestly, at this point, I'm not surprised. No word on what led to that shooting or who might be behind it. You're now looking at the scene of another deadly shooting. Authorities tell us this one appears to be accidental. A 48 year old man was killed early Sunday morning on the northwest side on Lily Lane, that's near Georgetown Road. An hour before that, we talked to investigators at the scene of a gas station shooting. A 19 year old was shot behind the wheel of a pickup truck. It happened at 21st and Shaveland around 11 o'clock. Witnesses say an argument led to that shooting. We don't have details about the motive. There are endless possibilities that could range from stealing, a, stealing something worth $10 or talking uh, to someone else's girlfriend. Narcotics, they don't care about anyone else but taking care of their anger or their issues at that very moment. Now, earlier in the day, a string of three shootings in under three hours. It started around three in the afternoon with a deadly shooting at 24th and Sheldon. A 44 year old man was killed. Then around four o'clock, two people were gunned down at a gas station at 38th and Georgetown. One was critically hurt, the other is stable. Then around 5.45, a woman was shot at 71st and Michigan. It happened at a KFC following an argument. The victim was badly hurt there. Officials describe her condition right now as very critical. And there have been no arrests in connection with any of these ongoing shooting investigations. And we'll continue following the very latest for you right here on Daybreak and on WishTV.com. Back to you. Lots to sort out there, Julia. Thanks for letting us know where things stand in each of those cases. Five minutes after 